Hi, this is Jeff Barr from Amazon.com. I'm here to show you a preview of something I've been working on for the last couple of months. The concept is called Dynamic System Modeling. I'm trying to create a Second Life model of a system powered by the Amazon Web Services and then show you how it works. Come on down and I will show you what I have built. There's still a lot to be done, but I really like where this is going and I can't wait to show it off. Here's the basic system model. Functionally, this setup models a system which fetches images from the web, scales and rotates them, and then makes them available online. In the center is an Amazon S3 storage bucket. The gray rectangles represent data flowing in and out of S3. The red, yellow, blue, and green boxes are Amazon EC2 instances. The yellow box is the front end web server. The red one is the web crawler. The blue box is the image scaler, and the green one is the image rotator. The curved purple containers are Amazon SQS message queues. I also have a control console in the center. Let's watch as some data is loaded into the Amazon S3 bucket. I had some book covers laying around, so I used them for test data. Now I'm going to enable the full simulator. At this time, I'm simply scaling up and down at random with a slight bias towards scaling up. This is just to make things look interesting while I explore the concept. You can see the images moving in and out of storage, and you can see EC2 instances starting and stopping in response to actual system load. This is still a prototype, and I definitely have some more work in front of me. I am excited by the potential to use Second Life to show how a real Amazon-powered system is built and how it works in real time. 